What's up? I am totally sitting in my car right now recording this. Um, this was my Tuesday. Follow f this is my day in life. This is already chaotic. I woke up at 7. I had to go to the gym at 7.30. Pulled some stretch in. You know how it is. I don't know. I just, I hate waking up early and I have to for track and for weightlifting. So here I am getting up, doing that. See how amazing it is? had to go to the bathroom obviously and change so I look so dead oh my god who hurt her um that's my favorite shirt anyways I tried to transition look how clean that was oh my gosh that's so cool Kayla um these are my leggings uh, no sweatpants I was putting on um showing off that they say HSU this says Humboldt State too they're totally both outdated because we're Kyle Polly Humble now but that doesn't matter um yeah i had to put layers on because it was cold this morning do i know how cold no but yeah anyways i brush my teeth totally do this every morning not just because i was recording um chose lifting shoes usually go with the reeboks because it makes me feel cooler but half the time i use converse yeah i grab my keys with my little thing i don't know i'm bad at this can you tell um, anyways, it was like raining this day, so it was really cold and I did not like it, but we have to go anyways. So I decided to drive up even though it's like a quarter mile walk. Um, yeah, it's 7.28 now, so I was running a little bit late, but that doesn't really matter, does it? Nah. Um, yeah, so cool thing about the campus is it backs Redwood Forest, so here's the trees. That's literally the forest, and here's Delena, my little lifting buddy. I'm one of my best friends. Love Delena so much. Here she is eating the camera. <laughs> um, you can tell that even though it's 7.30, we have so much energy just because we bounce off each other and just like always have a good time no matter what. So yeah, set up at our platform, started doing some warm ups. I totally look like I want to be able to do those squats. Amazing depth versus Delena who actually looks like she knows what she's doing. Put a little few good mornings in there. Delana's face in this looks hilarious. Sorry, Delana, I love you. Anyways, then we threw on some 25s, went through some progressions. We love progressions. Um, and then obviously after these, we have to cue me having a just casual breakdown in the middle of the gym, as one does. Um, anyways, we went into some block power cleans. We did some squats and other stuff. On some squat racks but I got too nervous to film because some of the basketball boys were there and I don't like people seeing me do things especially when I'm filming so I dropped Elaine off and then I went and got Starbucks and I did in fact use ones and coins to get it because <laughs> I am in college um, got a drink and a feta thingy and it did in fact break out the bottom like I didn't do it wrong like it just the bottom of the bag broke but I did enjoy it anyways. Don't really care that the bag broke because I was gonna eat it. This is me breaking the voiceover feature of this entire video, which was supposed to be the entire video through, just to genuinely rant about the fact that I've been back on campus for 10 minutes and have not found a single parking spot. Well, if you're thinking about Humboldt and you want to drive places, don't. Now that we got that out of the way, I finally parked probably about a quarter mile from my do dorm room. So here we have an amazing little time lapse of the entire walk that it took me to get back to my room. No, I did not enjoy it whatsoever, actually. Um, anyways, I decided to paint my nails. I don't know why, but that was in fact what I decided was important. I didn't do it well. Shut up, leave me alone. I'm not good at that side, like type of stuff. Um, I threw some makeup on super quick because I knew I wasn't going to be back into my room that day besides some quick stuff, so don't mind the fact that it looks bad. That doesn't matter. Shh. Leave me alone. Anyways, heading back out. Um, I have my bag this time. Money moves. So I decided I was going to go to the library super quick and get some studying in, which of course means I had to walk there because I wasn't going to drive to the library because there's no close parking lot. Love that. Um, so here's me walking in the library. Oh my gosh. Great stuff. <laughs> um, basically what turned into me deciding I was going to read like a chapter or two of this book and start working on it means I read an entire 400 page book in two hours before realizing I was actually running late to class. 
because what are the odds of me and being late to class? The answer is really high. I skip class a lot because uh, attendance isn't mandatory. So I'm almost never there, but that's fine. Anyways, I ended up walking over to class. So here's walking through the campus. That's Founders Hall. That's where all my classes are. And it's the oldest life. It's the oldest building on campus. Yeah, that, something like that. Anyways, um, here's me in class. This is me absolutely judging my classmates. And if you're in my class, I, uh, I'm not talking about you. Anyways, <laughs> here's me chatting. You know, being a star student, an amazing pupil, all of that. Um, and those are my toes. Anyways, um, after that, I had to get some mail because this was the Thursday before Easter. So my mom had mailed me some stuff for Easter. Anyways, that was the marketplace, which is food. Love food. Almost got it and then decided against it because there was so much stuff that I needed to get done before practice. Anyways, I thought I was going to go in for one package. There were three and they were big. <laughs> so I was not expecting that. So I ran back to my room to open them. This one is a hat I got for summer and for our, like sunnier practices and meets. Just so I had something to protect my head. And then this is a care package from my mom that's like through the school. And then she also sent me like a little Easter basket thing that had a foot mask in it. That was very confusing. But um, it also had these pants, which were super nice because I literally had no clean laundry and I was wearing sweatpants to practice and I hate wearing sweatpants to practice. So I changed into those. And then I brought all of the snacks that I wouldn't eat to practice with me because I always do that. And then I let my teammates eat them and it all works out perfectly for everyone. Thanks, mom. Um, anyways, here you can see the Redwoods again, just like littered through campus. Love it. So pretty. So nice. Um, this is the field. The long jumpers were out early and they're all over there. So hi, long jumpers. Um, I didn't really feel much of practice. Just us walking over and a few of my throws. This one is me messing up. And if you slow it down on my ankle when I mess up, it looks like I almost broke it, <laughs> which is great because I'm healing a sprain right now. Um, anyways, here's a good one love that that's jason and travis and travis doesn't like being on camera so guess what he did hit it um cool cool stuff um here's one last one of my throws right before the meet this weekend just got a few good ones in called it a day um went back changed into regular people clothes um decided to do my laundry because i needed my uniform clean for our meet the next day not the next day well we're traveling next day meet on saturday so started getting some laundry done ew the laundry machine looks gross anyways um walked over got food didn't film that because i hate filming in the like public areas especially dining halls don't know why that's so weird um switched my laundry over to the dryer did all that beep boop bop good stuff good stuff love it um then i started literally deteriorating i was just like laying down thinking about the fact i'd been awake for over 12 hours already and I wasn't anywhere near done. So I waited for my laundry to finish and then I walked back over to the library to get the rest of the homework done that I needed. And I had a study group for my geology class because none of us are that knowledge. So we're all helping each other out. So I got back in the library around seven, around 7.30 or eight. And I just started working. Um, this assignment, I better get an A on because I tried so hard. These are the people that were helping. We're all in the study group. Here's another time lapse because if you can't tell, I love time lapses. Um, so this is me finishing up that work and then finishing up a dialectic journal for one of my English classes. Um, also, if you're gonna come to Humboldt, 29 flights of stairs in a normal day, and that's a light day for me. Um, anyways, by 10:30 I gave up. I had to be at the track by 10 the next 9:30 the next morning actually. So went home, packed my bags, like did all laundry and all that, and that's it. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.